Hi everyone and welcome to my channel created by Ruby. This is a tutorial on how to make a fondant monogram plaque. First of all just start with some fondant with some tylos added to it or some gum tragacanth and then roll it out evenly. For this I used an oval shape but you can use any shape that you wish, square, round, whatever. And then just cut it out. And obviously you need to measure the size of the shape for the size of cake that you're putting it on. Once again I'm using the extruder gun which is quite priceless to me. And a really small hole. You just pop it in the end, put the colour fondant that you want in. For this I used like a grey tone and then wind the handle and it comes out like a piece of string. And this is what we're going to use to make the letters, the monogrammed letters, to go on the top of the plaque. Let's just roll out enough. And this is where it just gets a little bit fiddly, so you just need a bit of time and a bit of patience to do this. So I was making an S and an I for Sharon and Ian. And so I started with the S and I just used a, the end of a, a small thin paintbrush. You can use whatever you've got to hand. And then just made it into a, a sort of a shape with some curly bits on either end. And then you just need to keep sort of measuring it up against the plaque and then just fiddling a little bit to make sure that you get it how you want it. There's no exact science to this. It really is just how you want it to look. But this is how I did mine. So it just gives you an idea. So it has more of a curl on the bottom of the S and a smaller one at the top. And then I just sort of tried to carefully lift it over to make sure it was right. Didn't stick it down to start with because I wanted to make sure it was in the correct position with the eye as well. So I just sat it on there for now until I'd done both letters to make sure that they both fit on and looked how I wanted. So here again the eye sort of made this in three pieces. So I did the top and just curled the ends over. It's like a scroll And then there's just a straight piece to go in the middle. And then another sort of piece at the bottom for the bottom of the eye. And like I said, it is a bit fiddly. But as it's, it doesn't have to be exact, it's just how you want it to look. This was a little bit big when I transferred it over so I just had to cut down the, the straight part again to make it fit. And again like I said I didn't stick it straight on using water, I made sure I was happy with the look of it first and then I just went back and just painted a little bit of water on the plaque and then just sat the pieces on doesn't need to be edible glue or anything, water's sufficient. And once I was happy with it, then that just was attached with water again onto the front of the anniversary cake. You can see a video of that and I'll put a link to that in the details below. And there we go, it's really as easy as that. Quite effective. Thanks for watching this and if you'd like to see more of my tutorials or cakes in the future, please subscribe. Thanks again for watching. Bye.